everyone, it's Ike. Today I'm going to show you how to build a squeeze page using your AWeber code and NVU, okay? It's not difficult to do and it's super simple to do it. I'm going to show you right now with this screencast. Please enjoy and watch it all the way through. Okay, see you next time. Bye-bye. How to build a squeeze page with NVU and AWeber. A dead simple tutorial on how to do it. Super easy and you won't get lost, I promise. Okay, first thing you're gonna need is your AWeber account. This is gonna cost you about 12 bucks a month. Um, it's absolutely worth it because you can collect people's information and you can send them um, emails periodically and automatically, okay? Then there's NVU. This lets you um, edit HTML easily and without any hassle. And this is absolutely free. It's open source, very reliable, and it has great reviews. Uh, check them out online. Okay, once you download this and install NVU, you're going to want to open it up just like that, okay? And you want to concern yourself with only two of these tabs here, normal and source. But for right now, just focus on normal. Now here you're gonna want to write in your your hook. By the way, all this uh, all this information, I mean, all this jargon I'll be using, it's all in the um, in the article below. Just click that, and you get the whole written um, instructional manual for this video. So you can look it up, and if you have any questions, just uh, refer to the article. Okay. So first thing you want to do is write your hook. Okay. This is gonna contain um, a very quick little sentence that uh, will draw your target audience into your squeeze page something that benefits them something that is to the point so for example um, sign up today because that's what you want to do you want them to sign up and um, learn about this new fat no no and learn how to activate a secret fat burning en enzyme that will transform your body okay for example like that we have the sentence here and um, all you want to do right now is highlight this sentence center it and then uh, you're gonna want to break it apart so it like falls in it falls into itself so let's go to secret like just like that click enter just like that highlight it again you want to expand it with this big a here let's color that let's say uh, let's make this red and let's bold it just like that that will transform your body let's uh, Press enter again, just like that. Okay, good. So sign up today. So we have our hook that tells them what to do. Sign up today, and it tells them why. Because we're gonna we're gonna teach them how to activate a fat burning enzyme that will transform their body. This is good. Now below this, we're gonna put our image. So click enter again, just like that. And let's go to let's go to Google Images. And let's type in um, fat burning enzyme. Fat. Of course, you're gonna want to own this image. You, you don't want to rip off people. Um, enzyme. Did I spell that right? I don't think so. I wonder. Anyways, here we go. Fat burning enzyme. Okay. Go to view image and copy the link to the image. Copy the link to the image. Go here. Sorry. Go here and uh, click image and put.
put in the paste in the image link there and alternate text you're going to want to write something like sign up today and get this amazing information just like that click OK this is too big so just click on the image you see the little tabs here you can resize it by dragging these little tabs into each other just like that make it look nice okay we're closer closer good looks pretty good no what did you say so sign up today and learn how to activate a, a secret fat burning enzyme that will transform your body and here we have this image that correlates with our with our hook here okay you're going to want to save this for our purposes let's save as uh, SQ lander okay just like that save that okay now we have um, we're like two-thirds done I think we have our hook we have our image now we're going to want to put in the code so we, we can have the name and email areas right under the image. So for that, we're going to have to click on source, but that's for later. Right now we want to go and get our, we want to get our actual Aweber code. So let's say, for example, you're creating a new uh, list. Let's go to list options. Uh, you want to, first thing you want to do is put in the name of your list. This is an, a diabetes list I have. Um, and then put the description of your list. And then save settings, save settings. And it'll take you through. And finally, you en you'll end up on uh, sign up form. Okay, this is a sign up form. From here, we're going to want to go into um, the sign up form creation tab. Okay, Let's, let me give you an example here. So here... We have all these templates here. Once you load them, let's load this one here. Once you load them, you're gonna wanna delete all of the all of the non-essentials. And you just wanna leave it with the name, email, the submit button, and maybe the we respect your privacy button. I usually leave this on, but you don't have to if you don't want to. And then after you save form, going to go to the form here and you're going to want to put in the name of the form and the thank you page where the thank you page is located i'll teach you also how to make a thank you page um, right after we're done with this little tutorial guide here so then go to step three wait let's go back here and then go to raw html just like this copy that going to copy all of this go to your uh, squeeze page lander and sorry click source and then right under you see this image style all this code under image style you see slash big slash big slash slash divide you're going to want to just dump cut and paste that entire a web code right here boom don't worry about what this means or anything, okay? It's just doing it's just doing its job. Go back to normal and look what we have here. We have a functioning uh, squeeze page. Save it. Okay. We're almost done. Now you want to create your thank you page, right? So this is really easy. All you wanna all you wanna do is delete what you just did to be honest just delete the Aweber code boom delete the picture boom and with this information you just write thank you thank you let's get rid of that
Thank you for joining. Okay, just like that. Maybe you want to make this bigger. Boom, boom. And uh, you want to tell them, please check your email inbox to collect your free information okay just like that maybe you want to change the color here to black okay also um, I do and a lot of other marketers do they, they actually they actually have an upsell they actually sell something here maybe a Clickbank product or an affiliate product or something that's niche related you can put it right down here and uh, get a sale or um, get a conversion of some sort don't worry about that right now this is just I just wanted to mention that but this is just how to create a squeeze page uh, using NVU Aweber and also how to create a thank you uh, page after that you're gonna wanna save this as thank you like that click save and you're all done okay just like that so here's a, here's one I made earlier now you're gonna want to upload your squeeze pages onto your server wherever wherever your web host um, is you want to upload that information let's do that now to upload your uh, squeeze page and thank you page with your Aweber information and, and all that. You're gonna need an uh, FTP client. I use FileZilla, it's open source, it's free and very reliable and I just uh, recommend it to everybody. So once you do that, you're gonna wanna open up FileZilla, okay? On the left side here, this is where, uh, this is all your computer information, your actual, all the files on your computer. And on this side here, is where your website is and uh, basically your web host so for example I use HostGator if you use HostGator uh, and you put in the information up here host username and password then this side should give you access to your actual host okay uh, again this is the computer side so what you want to do is once you put in your host username and password don't worry about port don't worry about this you should go to public HTML and under here you'll see all your domains uh, for our purposes let's go to weight loss calendar okay and then on your computer side here you want to go where your squeeze page and thank you page are located so here's a uh, sqlander.html and um, thank you.html you want to get you want to highlight both of them and drag them on, drag them over to this area here. And just let it do its thing. It takes a couple of seconds. And you're done. Okay? Actually, I'm gonna delete these because I'm gonna give you another example that I've done earlier that I did earlier. There we are. Okay. So once you do that, um, you wanna check. That your, of course, that your squeeze page, your squeeze page, and your thank you page are working. So you want to go to the domain slash, for example, weightlosscalendar.org slash, and our squeeze page name sqlander.html. Here's an example of a squeeze page I did earlier that uh, is uh, that I used for one of my niches using the exact same te uh, techniques I showed you. So you put your name and email down below here. Your visitor clicks submit and they should be taken to the thank you page. Oh, the thank you page, okay. Here's an offer that I'm, I'm providing uh, the visitors to my squeeze page. Once they opt in, they get this free registry. Okay, so that's how you make a squeeze page. Simple as that, okay. You're gonna need your NVU, you're gonna need your Aweber code, 
you're gonna need FileZilla or another FTP client and of course you're gonna need a uh, website and web host so you can upload uh, your pages okay again if you like this tutorial uh, please uh, hit the subscribe button um, and uh, support this channel if you need any tutorial guides go to internetmarketinggym.com and if you want the templates I used in this uh, tutorial please visit to, uh, internetmarketinggym.com and get those uh, for free so have a great day and see you next time bye bye